pretty face after a long day's work. You saw the thief make a run for it? My back was to the wall, you see? Wasn't expecting someone to crawl out the window. He ran past me, dressed in gray, clutching the sword. That's all I saw. By the sun, my heart nearly seized up. Hope you and your family are well. I face the sun with you. Sun King Avad freed the people his father enslaved. Any news about my stolen sword? Not yet. I'll see what I can do about the robbery. The thief broke the lattice on the way out. And some blood. Looks like they cut themselves on the splinters. Drops of blood bleeding away. More blood. I'm still on the trail. Fight. Mark my word. Still more blood. The thief got cut pretty the trail ends here. But someone must have seen the thief. To load off. Did someone run past here, holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I paid for that thief's bandage. Captain Ursa. To attack with those damn shadow cars. If the thief came this way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. I could take it. Just an old thunder jaw that no one has defeated. That, that must be the spire. It's huge. Thief. Someone must have seen him go by. Did you see anyone run through here? He would have been holding a sword. Yeah. Almost crashed into me, too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way he'll catch him now. I didn't see a sword, though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. The thief must have ditched the sword. But where? Maybe he had help. That merchant style would have been a convenient drop-off. Just to refuse Jiran when he's It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with this. I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. You've got a reputation for a shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. You expect me to believe that? I can prove it. 
Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If they don't convince you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. But all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. Guess I should go to this water mill then to find out what's going on. are bickering again. Hmm. There's smoke from a dozen forges. Well paid work. Some cards are grumble about us. Metal bot here, good they prices, fair prices. Fairest prices for machine parts under the Mesa. No tithes to the Sun Court. Not like those greedy snarls upside. She's not interested in taxes. I know what she's not interested in. As I was saying, no better offer for snap ball lenses. I'd give my oath on it. By the sun, don't start spitting in your palm. Huntress, I apologize on behalf of my partner. Silent partner. Silent partner? If the sun would only grant my prayers. Never mind snap more lenses, Huntress. There's no market for those. A long leg lens, though, you'd be well rewarded for. So which... Uh, no market for a snap-maw lens is good, strong stuff. You can hammer it into anything. 
Where do you think we are? Some trading post with sawdust on the floor? This is Meridian. We have culture. I know culture. Just the other day I was watching the hunting trials. Oh, great sun, lend me the strength of midday. The sun's baked your head if you think we'll shift long leg lenses at a time like this. Uh, hello? I've told you as many times as the spire is tall, craft and artisanship is who we are. Craft doesn't win a war or keep the machines from your farms. What you need is good, old-fashioned, plain... Oh, yes. Old-fashioned, plain, hammered work. If ever something glittered, you'd throw it back. If Karja had built that elevator, they would have stopped at a good-looking shaft. All those years of delving, and you never found a sense of humor. Enough! Well? They're a blunt people, the Nora. Why do you two even work together if you can't agree on anything? <sighs> it's a symbolic gesture. No tithes to the Sun Court, like I said in the beginning, Renine. Just... just tell me which part you want. A long leg lens. A snap maw lens. Fine. I can see that you're busy. Wait, wait! You drove her off. Snap maw lens, what do you say? I drove her off? <laughs> That's rich. Listen, Huntress, long leg lens. Hunters, scroungers, bring us your metal. Scroungers? What kind of brutes are you trying to attack? We were agreed. I do the calling, you do the count. Long time. I do say a bit. Don't complain about your counting other than it takes too long. I just need to stop droning in my what? ear. But I tan this leather well. It'll keep. about your business, stranger. Might need that. I was told to expect you, Aloy. I suppose you want answers. Well, it's not complicated. We collect valuable objects from people who don't need them, sell them for shards, and use the money to help the needy at Sunfall. You mean you steal? If you want to call it that. From hogs who've had their turn at the trough for generations. Ravon didn't seem like a hog to me. He stinks just like the rest of them. Of wealth and contentment. While people beneath him suffer. Who exactly gets the shards at Sunfall? Not the bastards in the fortress. We use the shards to make sure the poor in Shadowside get to eat. 
or bandage their wounds. They only went west because they had to. Trust me, I know. My wife was chained up with a bunch of servants and herded with them. They starved to death, still bound together. I'm... I'm sorry. So am I. Where is the sword now? Safe. I haven't sold it yet. What do you expect me to do now? Walk away? I was hoping you'd help us. They say you can track like a stalker. Well, my partner Nassan disappeared near the branded shore. He was bound for Sunfall, along with an entire shipment of food. If you found that, you'd be helping a lot of people. I'll consider it. But only if you return the sword to Ravon. I knew you were gonna say that. Fine, I'll return the damn blade. Nassan was supposed to meet his contact at an old campfire on the fork near the branded shore. Start looking there. But be careful. Lots of machines out there, and lots of Shadow Karja. And not the needy kind, but they're tormentors. Move along. You have no need to loiter around here. This is where the Otaru wanted to say her goodbyes. That's it. I'm already gone.
This must be the sun's climb, where the Banuk wants to paint his mark. You are a better hunter than I. I'll paint the mark while the spirits of the Glinthawks linger. There'll be more where they came from. Yes. There will always be more machines. Their spirits find new bodies, but we only last as long as memory. That's why I must leave this story. A monument to our vanished shamans, To the wisdom the Karja bled from us. The machine oil in the paint will preserve it. Preserve their memory against all that was cut away. You have my thanks, Hunter. Getting too steep to ride.
Come to me for help. My duty is to go. It's a public monument, not his private shrine. You won't get in there. That dried up old prune in a robe sees to that. I can be persuasive. But what does an Osram want with a Karja shrine anyway? It reminds me of someone. Gone two years now. But what does a girl like you know of loss? Try me. I had a lover. Worked on monuments to their bastard king. Then he gave them a show in their sun ring for good measure. The Karja gave me back his broken bones, but what use are they? They won't build again. They won't make me smile. And seeing a statue of the Mad Sun King will? I, I need to see his work again. The marks his hands carved. The set of the metals they hammered. That's the soul of him. But that shriveled up old priest won't let me near it. I'll see what I can do. Turn away, child. The abiding Jahaman wishes to be alone in his retreat. If you want to be alone, go someplace else. Others want to pray here. Defile it, you mean? Yet another debasement of what was once pure. Truly, our tribe has lost the light. Our king is false, our temple is corrupt, and our soldiers weak. The sun hastens across the sky for shame. So the Karja have become impure? What does that even mean? Is Meridian not meant for those who built it, who made it great? It was pure before outlander squatters took it over. You mean Meridian was pure when the outsiders were in cages or dying in your arena? The sun is pure, child. It is not our place to question its divine will, only to act upon it. I thought Avad taking the throne was the son's will. The boy dishonored his father. Dishonored us all. To kill a son king. What shadow, what twilight time he brought upon us. And how many more would the mad son king have killed if Avad hadn't stopped him? The son called for blood. There was no choice but to obey. You called the temple corrupt. But aren't you one of its priests? They call themselves sun priests, but they have no authority. Youths and sycophants all. Yet those who gave their whole lives to the sun's service are shamed and ignored. So that's what this is. A tantrum? A cry for attention? You know nothing of our rights, and yet you dare to insult me. Why do you think your army is weak? Because you're not at war with everyone? A Karja throne relying on forged dirt mercenaries? Preposterous! The so-called liberation was nothing but a purge. Our most blessed warriors, chased out of the city, exiled to Sunfall and the Forbidden West. Our tribe is torn. The ones who walked in light now go by shadow. And yet everyone but you seems happy they're gone. I'm done arguing with you. Stay or go, but I won't allow you to keep others away. I am here by the will of the sun. If you won't accept change, you should try to make peace with it. Your bitterness has poisoned you. I have no need of your pity. I wasn't offering it. But if you step aside, you can keep your pride, since it's so important to you. There'll be a reckoning. You'll back away from it. Hey.
can't even read this last letter I got from the claim. And my paw must have been smashed when he wrote it. He gave them the best work he'd ever do. And look at it now. They defaced it because they hated what it stood for. They defaced a thing slaves like him lived and died for. Slaves they've already forgotten. Short-sighted bastards the lot. If they thought their son set off this bridge, they'd jump after it. I thank you for honoring my wish. I hope you can find peace. I wouldn't know what to do with it, any more than the Karja do. Who's gonna lead the Vanguard now? Erend? The boy's a drunken wreck since the bastard's got his sister. Is it just me, or do Karja people walk slow? They have places to be. Here's what I don't get about the sun. All these fancy decorations everywhere. It's downright embarrassing. Spring. Charcoal smoke from a dozen forges. They work. Decent liquor. How many shadow cards are bushwhackers? Uh, must have been a lot to take her down. of outsiders. I suppose they had good reason. Thunder jaw that no one is defeated. It's about to. Carja broke the ceasefire and murdered Captain Ursa. We should march on Sunfall as soon as we can.
When we fled from our cages during the liberation, I tore through this clearing, thinking my friend was behind me. I kept running, but here she remains. Thank you for making it safe for me to return. I don't want to rush you, but it won't stay safe for long. I understand. I've done this before in waking dreams. In the pool, I'll find the bracelet of seeds she dropped when she fell. The seeds will be split, escaped, grown wild. She's passing from my memory into the jungles. I'll tell her it was I who died here and became a stranger in our own land, and she who still lives in every time of planting, of rains, harvests, and... Oh. What is it? There. Her bracelet. And... I thought she was behind me. But there's only my reflection. Do you need to be alone? For the first time, I am. Charcoal smoke from a dozen forges. Well paid work, decent liquor. There's plenty of work here, but none I like. Adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. So you've come back to the temple. I was invited back. The priests wanted to hear what I had to say about reconciliation with the other tribes. They're listening. At least they've begun to listen. There's a distance between ears and deeds. Because of what we did? What you did. It was for the mourners. I think it helped them. You set them on the path. You can't know what their journeys hold. Such is the priest's lot. Perhaps a red robe would suit you. <laughs> Not me. Besides, your temple doesn't even take women. We would be richer if we did. Go in light, my friend. And let the sun cast your way. Thank you, Naman. Where I'm going, I could probably use all the light I can get.
these I've wares. I've got all the best goods here. Check out these wares. Don't take a look. I'll give you a good price. From an Hunters, rounders, bring us your metal. The Karja just needs some time. I brought you both the parts. So, what do you say? I don't suppose I could buy just the one. You'd buy the wrong one. So give the hunter her shards for both. Of course, of course. Here you are. If this is the price I have to pay... The price you have to pay? The Snapmaw lens might just cover the loss we take on the other. It won't sell for a loss, charcoal burner. You'd pay handsomely for a long leg lens if you had an imagination. I have an imagination. When you rattle that piece of junk around, I think of your skull. I told you from the beginning this wouldn't be a scrap dealing operation, that we would have class. And I told you, a true metal seller knows to get his hands dirty. for a fair price. And you wipe machine oil on my silks. Who wears a metal market? I do. Tasty. You'll like what I have for sale, I promise. Look, Would you like to buy I got a pair of sturdy Osram hands, and I know how to put them to use. There'll always be work for me. Come, take a look. I'll give you a good price. Not stopping when you're in the thick of it. My family might still be alive. You're You'll like what I have nothing? for sale. We've I lost promise. a dozen patrols beyond the valley. Don't Our know. orders are clear. Tell me what happened to your family. Maybe I can help. By the sun, I fear they are all dead by now. I barely escaped alive. Machines. Vicious machines attacked my family's estate. Father sent me to get help. What kind of machines? Where did they come from? A Ravager. By the sun, how it cut down those guards. And a pack of Watchers came with it. The Sun King warned us that he could no longer protect freeholds beyond the valley, but... Father never saw this coming. Tell me more about the estate. My father owns a dozen quarries, and he's put his spoils into the estate. Fine tapestries, custom woodwork, silver fixtures. But what about the people there? Of course. Their lives are all that matter. My father and sister, plus a dozen guards and servants. I hope they survived. I'll see what I can do about the estate. You will? Oh, thank you. Oh, please, be careful. Those machines are deadly.
like to see one of those nobles work the land. This must be Ronamon's family estate. what made these machines attack without warning. Thank you. I didn't really believe anyone was coming for me. I think everyone else is dead. Tell me what happened when the machines attacked. There were screams. I came running. The Ravager ripped through the guards like dolls. My father pushed me into the larder. I heard him kill a Watcher. Then, blasts from the Ravager's cannon. Silence. I tried opening the door, but he'd locked me in. He saved your life, and I'll never be able to thank him. Do you have any idea where the machines came from, or why they attacked so suddenly? We've been seeing more and more machines around here every year. That's why my father hired more guards. But they've never attacked like this before. I have no idea what caused it. Stay here. I'm gonna have a look around. I will. I need to take a moment with my father.
key. Wonder what it unlocks. That device is sending out a signal. Could be what attracted the machines. Okay, that should cut the signal. But someone put this here to call on the machines. And kill everyone on the estate. found a lure. I think someone might have put it here deliberately to draw in the machines. Did your father have enemies? <sighs> Raineman. My brother. First there was gambling, then stealing, then extortion. He swore vengeance when my father kicked him out. It was Ranamon who begged me to come. He needed the machines cleared out to claim the property. We can't let him. <sighs> that murderous snake. Can't let me do what, sister? Claim my inheritance? We shared a crash, murderer. Have you no honor? Oh, I guess not. But I will have this estate. When you meet father in the next life, tell him I'm enjoying his money. As for you, this little device will summon more machines. A lot easier than killing you myself. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. I'm glad there are good people like you in the world. It helps to make up for scum like my brother. My father was always generous in his gratitude. A family tradition I would like to continue. Take this. I hope it will help you in your travels.